Hey guys, Nick Finzer here, and I want to take a second today to talk about a couple of things having to do with flexibility and playing the trombone. Uh, I know we all do our flexibility exercises to get warmed up, and uh, sometimes, you know, things can get a little bit boring. For me, I like to break up into three groups all the different types of flexibility exercises. We have our ones that go through the partial series, maybe a three note slur like. Or even five. And then we have our kind of one partial going back and forth type exercises that might sound like. Etc. And then for me, the third category is usually the most fun, and that is using wide intervals. So first you might start off uh, just trying to use a major chord with the third displaced uh, in, in the overtone series. So we play B flat, F, and then we'll skip up to D and back down. So we play something like... With that in mind, we, we don't have to stay in only one position to play a flexibility exercise. And what I like to do is group them into intervals. So I have two exercises. I'm going to show you the first being in fourths. And what we do, we'll start on B flat just like normal. But instead of going up the partial series, what we're going to do is we're going to go up in fourths. It sounds something like this. Etc. Etc. We keep going down. It's all in fourths. So if you speed it up, it can be a little challenging. It's a, it's a little bit more fun than just playing only up and down the partial series. It gets things working a little bit better. Now what we can do is the same thing with fifths. And so here's that exercise. And continue all the way out to seventh and then even up past B flat into the upper register. There's a bunch of ways you can combine all of this information to create new exercises on your own, uh, but don't limit yourself to only playing flexibilities uh, in one position. There's all kinds of ways to move them around the horn and uh, keep on building our skills. If you're interested in seeing those exercises written down and maybe some other stuff too, you might want to check out my book. It's called Get Ahead, a practical guide for the developing jazz trombonist. It'll help you to go from where you're at to get to the next level, whether that's to get into a college or a master's program. But uh, love to hear from you and see what you guys come up with in terms of flexibility exercises uh, that don't stick in one position. And uh, would love, can't wait to hear those. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.